Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Sag with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see how you're coming to the reading, Sagittarius. I was texting. All right, so writing something down. Um, maybe even trying to bring something into fruition. This could even be magic. You know, um, this could be writing, yeah, understanding. Maybe you're trying to get someone to understand your point of view also. You're very passionate about something. So you could be writing something now. It could be texting, emailing. Um, yeah. So this could be a feminine energy. It could be a female. Maybe a male is texting a female or vice versa. Um, somebody could be in their feminine energy. They're trying to save the connection or the marriage here. Maybe your person is texting you, Sag, and they're trying to save the connection because um, they're at a place of uh, being completely obsessed with you. You know, they stare at your picture for hours um, and they feel safe with you. So whomever this is, is they're trying to get you back to a comfortable place of maybe believing in them. They want newness with you. They want a new life, you know, new home, new baby, new car. They want everything. Um, so it's like maybe somebody trying to pull you back in. Let's see. Or you're trying to pull someone back in. That is your energy. But um, it could be what someone is doing to you or vice versa. This is what you're doing. Let's see how your person, your person of interest, how they feel. Okay, so they feel like they're deserving or maybe that you're deserving of, okay, um, that that uh, the energy is gaining momentum here. They're going to have to do something or make some change. They feel like um, maybe you're very seductive, okay, or you did something very seductive. Um, let's see, or you're very sexy. They feel like maybe you're hiding. Yeah, okay, so they feel like, and I got this too and I didn't say it. Maybe they, they feel like you have other affairs that maybe you are promiscuous or there's a sense of promiscuity. This person feels like maybe they deserve more or you deserve more. Or you need to treat yourself better. They feel like you have other people. You know, maybe they feel like it's hard for you to, to come to that determination or it's hard for them to stay in this connection. How does this person feel? Yeah, you know, they feel like maybe you say a lot, um, but the, you really want the relationship to be platonic or maybe when you got caught with somebody or maybe when they inquired about a person about maybe a masculine energy excuse me <coughs> excuse me guys when they inquired about somebody about these affairs you 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 came up with some real fast words you were a fast thinker and maybe even told them that this person is platonic um but you know, that they're just a friend and uh, they, but this your person is bothered and they feel like they're being a doormat and they fear the worst they fear that maybe something hasn't changed it's the same okay let's see what the advice is for you Sag moving forward what's the advice for Sagittarius and these messages can be uh, vice versa mediation meditation brings answers so you need to get to a quiet place. If you're all confused, it's because you won't listen to your intuition. Your heart and your mind are in two different places. You need to get to a place of grounding and balance. Okay. Wow. I didn't even look at the cards. It says listen to your intuition. Yeah. Um, yeah, you're all over the place. Okay. Um, if you know that this person has other people, either giving them money or paying them for sex, I don't even know why this is coming up, then it might be very well true. Um, and it, yeah, I'm out of here. So this is what I have for you, Satch. If it resonates, go over to the website, book there, ask, answer, ask a question uh, or two by texting it to the number below. You can also come catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where I do a collective reading and then I answer questions. Thank you, Satch. Many blessings to you. Take care.